in this video i am going to show you how to sort the characters of a string so suppose we are given a string like this one and we want to sort all the characters of this string so in order to do that c++ already comes with a function called sort this function comes with uh, algorithm.h header file and it sorts any given a string or vector or array anything all we have to do is pass the beginning position and the end position and this uh, i mean function sorts the given entity in order of n log n time so let's first see how this is implemented so what we will do is we will include all the header files and we will pass our string and then we will simply pass the begin and end position of this uh, uh, string so this algorithm is in place algorithm it means it will sort the string itself it will not create a new string so we will get the output like this one so let's try to run this one first okay okay so it is compiling okay so that is compiled and this is the output which we got after running of this program so this is using the inbuilt algorithm of c++ now what we want to do is we will build a efficient approach for sorting really really big strings because you see the time complexity of this algorithm is order of n log n so the efficient approach would be to create a hash map i mean a kind of um, map where we store how many characters are available in each uh, in the string so there are two, 256 characters possible as per the ascii value and we will create an array of 256 values and we will iterate over the string and if uh, uh, depending upon the ascii value of the character which we go through uh, we will increment the counter for the string so this is exactly what we are doing over here what we are doing is creating a hash map of 256 characters and then we are uh, initializing it the entire element uh, the all, all each and every uh, element of the array with zero and then what we are doing is we are iterating over the string and depending upon what is the ascii value of the current string we are incrementing the value of the array so by the end of the this for loop we will have an hash map in which we have we will have all the frequency of every character so right after that we will visit our we will iterate over our hash map and then we will print the i mean what is the count of the that that character what is the frequency of that character and depending upon that we will print the character that many times so this is the efficient approach and this will as you can see this will run in order of uh, n time because this will iterate over the entire string n time and then it will iterate over the hash map 
which will uh, I mean 256 characters which will have 256 elements so this is comparatively efficient approach for really really long strings so let us try to run this one as well okay okay so that went also well this was the string we passed and uh, that was the output we got so that is how you create an hash map of a binary uh, of the strings and then print them in efficient order so that's it